In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to move and copy files into a folder on a Mac. Currently on my desktop, I have an image, a keynote presentation, another image, and a PDF. Along with these files, I also have two folders, folder A and folder B. I'm going to begin by moving the bottom image into folder A. There are many different ways to do this, but perhaps the easiest is to simply go ahead and click, hold, and drag on the image and move it into the folder that you want. I'm going to go ahead and do that at this point. Click, hold, and drag, and let go. Just to prove that image is now in folder A, I'm going to go ahead and open up folder A, and as you can see, the image is currently inside of folder A. Another common way that people like to move a file into a folder is by having a folder open, like I currently do on the screen, and simply dragging and dropping the file into the actual folder. And as you can see, my image is now in folder A. So that is how you go ahead and move a file into a folder, but how do you copy a file into a folder? And what I mean by copy is, let's say, for instance, I want to go ahead and copy this keynote presentation and leave it on my desktop, but also put a copy of it into folder A. Well, there are many ways to do this. I could simply go ahead and click on the actual file. You can see it's selected. I could use the keyboard shortcut of Command C, come over here to my folder, and then go ahead and click on the folder and then select Command V. And as you can see, it has been copied and pasted into folder A. Another way to copy is once again, click on the file you want to copy, go to the menu bar, select edit, and then copy, and then go to the folder you want to go ahead and copy the file to, select the folder, go to edit in the menu bar again, and select paste item. At this point, you'll see a little pop-up box that has appeared on my screen. What this is basically telling me is that I already have a file in this folder with that same name. Do I want to keep both? Do I want to stop it? Or do I want to replace it? In this case, I'll just go ahead and select replace. While using a keyboard shortcut or the menu bar is one way to copy a file, a lot of people would just simply like to go ahead and click, hold, and drag a file into the folder and just copy it that way. However, if you do that, that doesn't copy a file, it moves a file. However, if I hold down the Option key and then click Hold and Drag, I'm able to copy the file into the folder, as you can see on the screen. Again, the Option key and then click Hold and Drag and then you'll be able to copy the file as opposed to move the file. So I just demonstrated a variety of ways to move a file and to copy a file into a folder on a Mac. The same principles will work if you're moving one file from one folder to another folder. So currently I have folder A open, and if I open up folder B, you'll see here, there they are, and folder B is empty. Once again, if I click, hold, and drag, I can move one file from one folder to another folder. Or if I go ahead and hit Command C on a selected file and then come over to the other folder and hit Command V, I'm able to copy and paste from folder to folder as well. The menu bar feature will also work the same as it did before. And also, just like before, if I press and hold on the Option key and then click, hold, and drag, I'm also able to copy a file from one folder to the next folder. Well, there you have it, a variety of ways to move and copy files into folders on a Mac.